What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com and in the last Dynasty video we took on Florida International. As you can tell by the score we had no issues there. Just pretty much the same game we've been having this entire Dynasty. Just the CPU offense struggles. But we still have some more games to play to finish out the season and today we're taking on I guess our most important conference game of the season going up against 25th ranked 8-0 Arkansas State. Looks like they run the ball extremely well. Their defense is go, doing well. I don't see any bad problems there. And just by looking at the scattering report, they run a basic pro-style offense, 4-3 defense, but they favor to run a little bit. So we'll see what happens. I'd like to think that they could, you know, move the ball on to some, but we'll see if that happens. Now, in the last video, recruiting was very interesting. We ended up getting four commitments from guys that didn't even visit. That never happens in 06. It appears that it happens in 07, which is pretty cool. It just saves you some time from having to have anybody come and visit if they really want to come to your program. Damian Cumby, the running back, wide receiver, Lawrence Craig, Matt Graham, tackle, and middle linebacker, Victor Dowdell. All of them committed, so now we're down to these two guys, corner Travis Moss and wide receiver Drew Barnes. I got the points split at 50 apiece. Travis Moss isn't ready to take a visit yet. But we're in great shape for him. We already know he likes one of our pitches. And Drew Barnes is ready to take a visit today. Let's see. Program prestige, coach prestige, uh, location, and academics. So we can pick coaching style. We could do location. Being a three-star. Oh, yeah. We can't do location. Oh, we can do playing time or coaching style. I can go off one of those. I don't think it matters a whole lot. Let's go coaching style and see if he reacts to that. Let's go to ESPN, the magazine. Uh, Ward semifinalist, I don't mind looking at this. This is the first time we've seen that this season, I think. I could be dead wrong. It's been about a week or so since I've been playing this dynasty. Looking at the Maxwell, the Big Narek. I don't know if we'd have anybody on any of these lists except maybe the coach award. Quarterback... Walker, Suber hasn't ran the ball well enough. Wide receiver, we don't have one guy just taking command. This is the one, Chicola. He's been our best player all season, just having a great year, and he's number two on the list, right behind a tight end from Toledo. That guy's got 426 yards and six touchdowns. Our guy has 536 yards and six touchdowns. So we're just right in the thick of it. As long as we keep, you know, uh, focusing the entire scheme around him, I think he has a good chance to win it, but it's really cool to have a tight end on here. It's been a while since I've had one make the list. Offensive line, I don't think we'd have anybody here. Remington, I doubt it. Looks like Tennessee's got a bunch of players on here. Uh, Lombardi, I don't think we'd have any defensive guys. I just don't can't think of anyone that stood out and that done much. Groza, we don't kick enough. We don't punt enough. Return, we've had a couple returns, but but from two different guys in the coach award, we're not on there either. So it looks like it's the tight end award, and that is it. So that's one thing we can focus on. We don't have to go through all these every single week. Now let's go to conference standings, and we will check out the team info screens. We'll start off with us first. We're pretty healthy. Our same six guys have been doing their things all year, especially on offense. Just a quarterback, running back, tight end, all playing well. Defensively, it's been a little bit of everybody, but Hofacker, our best linebacker, is playing pretty well. Mosley is really turning things on in the sack category. I think he broke the single season record for the school in the last game, if I'm not mistaken. Now let's check out Arkansas State. Their starting quarterback is out. How lucky is that? But they are a run-heavy team, so that doesn't say a whole lot for me. I think they're still going to hand the ball off quite a bit to it looks like the Arnold kid. Averaging over 100 yards a game. Good for him. Looks like they got just a little bit of everybody doing stuff on defense. And they just beat Navy in the previous game. I think I am ready to take on Arkansas State. So we can go ahead and get right to it. Fingers crossed. We haven't had anybody get in any serious trouble this year. Discipline has been way down. And it looks like it's the same today. Let's go with our alternate home uniform today. I don't think we've used that in a while. I'm looking forward to it 
ramping this dynasty up. I've 07 hasn't been as bad as I thought, but it, it, I'm just having a hard time getting much of a challenge out of these teams. Yes, I know I've got two losses, but that's a lot of that's due to just turnovers on my end. And my biggest thing is just the CPU offense just can't get going. It doesn't matter who I play. Then I'm I want to focus on one dynasty, and I love my 06 Hawaii dynasty. But I do want to finish out this season. Okay, it looks like we got a lot of rain today. We'll see if that affects turnovers and such. We've had some pretty weather all season so far. Good looking uniforms there. They're going to highlight him as expected. I kind of hope he puts on a bit of a show. Let I me mean, just show that, you know, CPU running backs can do something. I think what's really hurt this game compared to 06 in terms of CPU offenses is they really toned down the impact guys, like, big time. They don't. They can't find a happy medium. A lot of people think 06 impact players are juiced up, and I can see that point at times. Looks like they won the toss, and they will kick it. So we're going to get the ball first. We're going to go to in-game strategy and check out their roster. Their quarterback is out, but their backup can run a little bit, so we'll see if they use his legs much. Arnold is going to get most of the load, I would think, but he's not an impact guy. Fullback, they got an impact receiver, so it makes you wonder if they're going to throw a little bit more than what I expect. Not a whole lot else behind him, just your average Sunbelt wide receiver unit. Decent little tight ends. Two guys right there I wouldn't mind using. Neither one can catch all that great, but they can move a little bit. You can do some 12 personnel stuff with that group. Offensive line, uh, 70s and 80s, nothing great. Just your typical Sunbelt offensive line. Like I said, they run a 4-3 defense, 82 and 86 on the ends with backups to match. That's a pretty good group there. Defensive tackles, they're okay. So their front four's not bad. 78, 78, 62, right that, right, that kid right there. Maybe we can exploit that somehow. He is the right outside linebacker, which means he'll be on our left for the most part. Corner, a really good starting corner, and the number two guy. And eh, not a bad look corner group. An amazing free safety, one of the best in the country, at least in terms of talent. We'll try to stay away from him today. That's a rarity finding a 90-plus overall guy in the Sun Belt. Wow, their strong safety is even better. Their secondary is not bad at all. At least they're two safeties. So we will probably... Uh, wow, they got a good corner, too. This is going to be interesting to see how we handle their secondary. This is by far the best we faced in the conference, at least. And that's about as good as a secondary as we've seen this year. That includes the two uh, power five teams we played early in the year. Average kicker, average punter. I think we're ready to go. Maybe this is the game we, you know... Arkansas State can really do something, or I should say the opposing team can do something. We'll return this with Henry. Not a whole lot there. We'll make our one sub-package adjustment. Let's start off with a basic throw. Looks like they're going man 4-3. We will go to Subra on this one. I hit that button way too early, but we're going to get the first down at least. We will decline that. That's why I, I hit the button twice trying to snap it. I was very fortunate to get sacked. We will decline that. We can run the ball with Subra. Looks like they're going with a man under front. Wow, they are biting on the fakes a ton right now. I'm going to get close to the sideline. I don't want that guy to, you know, force fumbles on us. So that's twice they've bit on that. We're going to decline it, though. We got extra yards. Good start so far. Let's go with Snag. 
or going man. The Blue Raiders are lining up with three receivers. Drops back to pass. Looks number 12. Gun Good throw there to Williams on the curl. Boy, did he zip Pick up ball in nine. Let's go here, and I have this on my mind. We're going to go slants. We're going man or they're going dime. We will probably run this ball. I think that's the smart choice. We're going to go to the left. Good little run there. Just took advantage of the dime situation. We had a lot more guys in the box than they did, so I would have done a formation audible since I'm using a default playbook. You can use default or uh, formation audibles if you use one of those default playbooks, not create your own. Good little run there. Pretty simple. We're still on the left hash. I want to Let's just stick with the same play. Okay, now they're going with a bigger set, so I don't mind sticking with this. Let's look at our... Mm, I don't mind see if we can get the Williams if they go cover zero, but they're not. I just want to make sure our tight end gets to touch the ball there. So it's second and four. I want to him to touch it again. We'll go or do our first curl flat of the day. We're going zone, so I do want my tight end to catch this one. Oh, man, I don't know. We're going to spread it out. Uh, hopefully they don't blitz super hard. Nope, they're not going to. Fumble. That's That was our fear. One of those impact guys was going to force a fumble. And that's what happened. No point even looking at it. That was my fear. I just hope this isn't a turnover fest today. Oops. I forgot I'm playing 07. Press the wrong button. <laughs> Second and 12. I'll stick with man a lot today. Of course, I expect them to run quite a bit, too. Play action. Ah, right, good play. Pick up the first. I'll still stick with a one. Oh, they're going four wide. Let's do dog gold. Not sure how I feel about my free safety on that guy, but... Ah. I was way out of position. I could have made a play there. It's second and ten. This is just a great play Let's do quarters. I thought they was going three wide. Dang it. They may make a play here. Ah, look at this. Dang it. It said they was going four wide. That's why I went nickel. It says they're going with a big front here, so we'll go with the 46. It was a good push in the line. Pick up another first down. They got to tell me what the... It says they're going three wide right here. I'm going to do a one hat of 4-3. And it says they're going two wide. Now you see why I get upset over that. It said they went three wide. Now they're going two. Good stop there. Sister going too wide here. We'll do another one high. I just expect them to run it. They shift on the defensive line. Arnold gets a talk. All right, so it's third and six ish. We will. Uh, 
We'll do basic cover three. He's got all day to throw. There we go. Somebody came through. That's good. So we're going to get the ball back. Somebody made a good move. I think it was one of the defensive tackles. We will... Let's do an all-out block. A little too close to midfield for me to try to do a return. We're going to come in to block, or to protect. Somebody get a block. Block. Good little play there. Let's go back. Let's pick this play. Uh, let's run the ball. If I can find it, I want to do toss. They're going man. We'll go to the right. Good blocking everywhere. Good blocking. Good play there. Let's go back. I want to make sure my tight end gets back in a groove. We'll go back to curl flats. We're going man here, so he may not get it. I'm going to audible or hot route. Him to a go. Wow, just all the kinds of pressure came through right there. Just no blocking. So that's third and forever, or second and forever. We will try. We need those yards back. This may be too early for me to try to do this, but we're going to go split in drag. Go in zone. Ah, come on. So it's third and forever. Uh, it may not matter what we call here. We'll go deep comeback. We're going man. We're going to do that. This is going to go to get my tight end or to Henry. Nice, first down. So we'll break this play down. What I've done was, one of the cool things with 07, I wish 06 had, was the smart route. And smart route is, you know, here is the first down marker. Well, this comeback was only come to go right there. I needed to get to the first down marker, and this is a good man beater. So I just done a smart route to get it to the first down marker, and it ended up working perfectly. So that was pretty cool to see. Good little play there. Let's do basic slam. We may not get this playoff. Uh, yeah, okay. All right, end of the first quarter. It's still 0-0. Zero, zero. I feel pretty confident right now. Not too worried about anything yet. We're going zone here. Nope. Fullback just didn't block all that well. The guy came through on the edge. Let's see if we can go back. Let's do tight end corner. We're going zone here. I'm going to do that just in case. Uh, bad throw. Just another bad throw. He's throwing it high, throwing it low. He's not having a good day so far. We'll go back to deep comeback. We're going zone. This will go to one of the receivers more than likely. Nope, went man. And that was a terrible throw. Just not an awful throw. Short armed it. All right. Uh, we will... We're on the 38. I'm going to go for this. 
We'll go back to split and drag. Going zone. Middle Tennessee State in a four wide set. Look at the throw. Looking. Rolling out to the right side. Number 12. Ah, swear. Somebody catch the ball. It's not hard. Just catch it. But those safeties are making plays. But I, don't, I mean, what else can you do? It wasn't a good throw either. He had to stop for it. So we got to come up with something. Ah, good, good catch. First and ten. Let's do quarters and see what happens. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coca-Cola. Jennings with a nice play fake. He lets it go. Intercepted. No, no. <laughs> I forget. Oh, and I, I hurt myself. Injured my elbow. <laughs> I hit the circle button to spin. I forgot its speed button is X. Either way, good little play. Somebody tipped it and I was able to pick it off. I'm going to go back and look at it. I had nobody to cover on my end, so I just covered the impact guy making the crossing route. Good tip by Hofacker, and I was able to pick it up. So we got to take advantage of this and get some points. <laughs> I do, if I do say so myself. Let's just go back to curl flat again. Going zone. Leave the protection as he is. All right, at least he caught it. Another bad throw, though. He threw it behind him. So Craddock, I'm trying to get Craddock going a little. Maybe he can get a little more accurate, but it's just another bad behind. He threw it behind him. Very fortunate we got the yards we did. Let's go. Let's go wide receiver corners. They're going man here. I'm going to have him do that just in case. Somebody came through. Jump to snap. Yep, snap got me, so now it's third and whatever. Third and nine. Ah, man. Well, it's good to see their defense play well. They're going man here. Uh, I'll probably leave it as is. Pick up the first. I think, thought I was going to get sacked again. Let's run the ball, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Let's go slam. They're going man. Let's go. Good play right here. I'm not going to juke. It's not worth it. Not on that guy. So they got a player hurt. Let's try. We're on the left hash. Oh. Let's try another run play. Let's go counter again. They're going man. Uh, I don't know what to think about that shift. We'll go to the left. Just getting her. Every hit is just a, a clothesline or a body slam. They felt like it was a good idea to introduce that in 07. Just one hit after another is just a big impact hit. And we're going to go to Super here. Hopefully he can. Nope. Just don't. Mm. Okay. We are on the four yard line. And he is gassed. Uh, let's go. Let's spread him out. Let's see how they handle that. Let's go turn in. They're going zone. Touchdown. And it was an offsides. 
that Jacob, that little curl, the slant stop, slant curl, whatever you want to call it, is great against man or zone. So we will accept that, or we'll decline it for the touchdown. So good to see the tight end get in the end zone, Jacoa. I'm just glad we got on the board, finally. We'll kick an extra point. So we'll get back on defense. Two and a half minutes. I'd like to get one more score before half. We got an impact guy on the right. I need to kick it on the other side. This is actually the first time we've kicked off, if I'm not mistaken. Great play. They got terrible field position. Uh, let's do quarters. I'm not will. I'm not ready to blitz this guy. I'm afraid he'll just run away from it. Counter. Good defense, Al. Good defense. Second and ten. Let's do the over front. I'm going to do quarters again. I think they're going to pass here. So it's second and ten. Linebackers move over. They're really struggling now. Do our bump and run. Absolutely insane. I'm curious if they're going to try to run clock. They're just going to run it. Another stop by me. I'm going to wait. We'll go back to the 46 bear. And I will call a timeout after this one. I'm assuming they're going to run it. They're trying to get us offsides, and somebody may go offsides. I don't blame them being third and fourth. They're going to pass it. A good stop. Fourth and three. We will call a timeout. And uh, we will go. Uh, let's just do team. Let's do an all-out block. Somebody may be able to go through. We got a decent return off of all-out block last time. Nobody came through, but I should get some yards. Eh, let's just, yeah, no point in getting hit. We need to get down the field a little bit. Let's go. Flanker curl. Haven't got to call this yet today. We're going man. I am. I'm going to leave that protection as he is. We'll do that. Terrible throw. Gosh, that was an awful throw. Uh, let's go. I'm going to go back to the play we just scored a touchdown off of. Let's give Craddock something simpler to throw to. I don't know. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Ah, just somebody came through. I think maybe Holden. Holden. Yeah. Second and 20, or they may decline it. Nope, they're going to keep it. Second and 20. Man, the coaches are going to have to talk to these young guys about committing unnecessary fouls. We'll do a deep comeback from here. Going zone. Which is my preference. Going cover three. No, wrong. I pressed the wrong button. I'm an idiot. <laughs> That's what I get. I just pressed the wrong button. My comeback was wide open. Oh, that was terrible. My bad. All right, let's try it again. Can't tell. They're going zone. Okay. I think. I don't know. Oh, we'll take it. That's fine. <laughs> just a crazy play. They went man. I should have went with my gut on that one. So I just went to the cover zero beater. So we need to get down the field a little bit. It's 53 seconds. We got two timeouts. I'm just trying to think. Let's just go back to curl flats from here. 
We'll go to our tight end really quick. We can get to the line. Middle Tennessee State lines up with three receivers. First down. Dang it. Just our offensive line is playing so bad right now. Look, they just just awful. My left guard, I don't know what he's doing there. This is another thing that kind of bugs me about this game. It's just I don't know what he's doing. I, I just don't. That's that's just bad. Oh, okay. I'm going to call the same play. I don't care. Going zone. I, I'm just trying to find a way to give the Chicola. This is like the simplest way to do it against zone at least. I'm not going to call a timeout, though. I'm at the point where I'm kind of debating where to just go to half. We're going man here. Let's do that. We'll call a timeout. 13 seconds. I know I need to get down the field. Uh, we'll go offense and offensive line. Apparently they need it. Let me see. I feel like I'm forgetting a play or two. Uh, I want my tight end to... We've had a hard time. We'll do split end drag. We're having a hard time with it. We can't seem to get anything to connect. He keeps getting his bell rung every time. We're going to... Dang it. Uh, we're going to... I'm going to call one more time out. We're going to try to kick a field goal. I think I got one left. Okay. Whoo! I, th I thought I wasn't going to do it. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to go offense and backfield. I think that'll help the kicker. Hopefully we can make this and get a 10-point lead and go to half. Uh, barely, barely, barely. So we got some points out of it. So it's 10 nothing and a half. Pretty entertaining game so far. I wish our offensive line would do a little bit better, but I, I need to find a little quicker ways to get the ball out or just run the ball more. And I'm running the balls, and I've been helping a whole lot. So, actually, our running average is pretty good. I guess I do need to run the ball more. Maybe that's what the problem is. Anyway, again, what's the theme of this game so far, for me at least, is CPU offense just can't do squat. 42 total yards of offense. The rest of this stuff, I don't think it matters at this point. Their third down is bad, like it has been all year. The rest of that stuff doesn't mean a whole lot to me. So let's just get right to the third quarter. They do get the ball started in the third. I didn't mean to kick it on that side. I guess the accuracy wasn't where it needed to be. It's a good stop, though. Uh, let's do just cover one. One thing I didn't check. I need to go back and look. Let's go stats and scores. A grand total of 13 plays for them. Of course, I know we're playing. It's a video game and it's five minute quarters, but still. What I wanted to see was how they're running the ball more than they're throwing it, which is what I expected. So. Fumble. Yeah, they got it back though. Second and 14. We'll do quarters for now. And yeah, I just now realized I probably could be playing man the entire time like I did in the last game, but it, I don't think it matters at this point. That's a glitch play. Another monster hit. So, for example, we can go. Cover two, man out of nickel. Let's see if I can get around this guy. Just nobody open, and now he got hurt. So now their third string is going to be in there. Entered his hip. Interesting. Either way, they didn't do nothing on offense, so we're going to get the ball. Uh, let's, do, let's do a return. Let's do a double cross. 
not a shoot double cross like in wrestling, like the Montreal screw job. We're talking about a football double cross. That's why I need to add to the channel's wrestling stuff. You don't know how big of a fan I was back in the day when it was really good. All right, somebody make a play. We're going to get a touchdown. I asked for it. Nope, he's going to catch me. Hey, good job. So why are we run the 12? Let's run the ball. Let's stay here and let's try counter from ace normal or ace big, whatever they call it. We're going zone. Ooh, we will run to our right. Didn't want that impact guy to make a play there on the four. I wonder. Let's do slam. I'm sure they're going to go goal line here, and they are. I was trying to create a bunch of gaps. This is the only way I know how to do it, because we don't have a big set in this formation. They don't have any other safeties in there. Yeah. That's about what I expected. That was my fault. I should have called something different there. Third and two. Let's do a toss play before I... Yeah, they are going to goal line. That's what I expected. Nope. Perfect defense. Yeah, that was just my fault. Uh, fourth and five. Let's just kick a field goal. I think that's a smart play. So that was a blunder on my part. Again, I could have went... I don't trust the goal line formation in this game. I don't think it works all that well. And I don't have another bigger set. That's the only downside to this playbook, which is the cow playbook. There's no big set in the game, or in the playbook. So I got to adjust. So I wanted more points out of that, but that's okay. We'll get back on defense. We haven't heard anything about their quarterback. He may come right back. May have had a hit pointer or something like that. It says they're going with a big set, so we will do the same. Let's do crash gold out of 46. And their quarterback is out for the remainder of the game. So their third stringer, this guy's out, this guy's out, and their backup is only at a 72 speed. So now I can maybe do a zone blitz or two if I felt like it, but or I can just stick with man throughout. You want to pass it? <laughs> How lucky can you get? Bounced off and landed right into a guy's arms. Second and five, we'll go with a one high. Do our basic under front. I think he got the first. Third and inches. So we're going to go with a big set. We'll do the same. Let's do this Thunder Green. I'm going to take a chance on this one. I normally would prefer a safety to come down. Just good push. Yeah, good push by the offensive line. We'll go back to one high. Make our little adjustments. Counter. Get about four yards there. Pick up six. I'll call a lightning gold. Pretty much the same thing we've been calling. And that's a glitchy play. I think he ran into his own. I think he ran into the fullback here. Yeah, I just I know how they feel. So it's third and nine. And we can do a basic cover two man out of nickel. I'll control this guy. Uh, come on, get around him. Almost got a sack. It's the bath throw, and we're going to force another punt. We'll do a double cross. I 
Just realized they got a lefty punter. I really want to get a touchdown. It's been a while. Somebody get a block on that dude right there. And we may get a touchdown here unless somebody comes through on the last bit. Looks like it's not going to happen. Six points. This time I'll run into the end zone and not try to dive at the one like I've done before. And now it's going to be hopefully 20 to nothing. So I don't. It would have helped if their starting quarterback would have played, but let's be honest, would that would have made a difference. I, I doubt it. Even if they gain an extra 100 yards, an extra 200 yards, that means they still would only have like 250 yards right now. Mm, that's a good block by the guy, but wouldn't made a difference. First and ten. Go one with another big set. We'll just do four three. One half for now. Take a look at the offensive production numbers brought to you by Coca Cola. Arkansas State comes out with two tight ends. This one is somebody almost got another sack. Second to ten. We'll do cover two man at a nickel. Pressure coming from and so on that you lose focus at times throwing a catchable ball. Here he just missed the target. Leonard is back in the gun. Leonard, back to throw. Leonard, let's it go. Got it to the senior. Good completion. Just didn't get anything out of it. So it's third and nine. I'll, I'll stick with the same play. That's fine. I'm giving the most basic coverage possible. Arkansas State in a four wide set. Leonard drops back. Steps up in the pocket. Just a terrible throw, but I got to remind myself there are third stringers in there. But. Let's do another punt return. Somebody get a block or two on the left. Just don't fumble it. All right, we're on the left hash. I want to go here, and we're going to go with a heavy counter. We're going zone. They're doing that. I will go to the left and do this. We'll do that. Get a block right there. Good block. Get the first down. Let's run the ball again. Let's do toss from this formation. We're going zone 4-3-ish. It's like the over front. So which way do you go? Uh, no, let's go back. I guess you can't flip it. Uh, that ain't good. Just don't fumble it. That's a bad loss of yardage. It's second and... End of the third quarter. We're up 20 to nothing. I want to dig myself out of this hole if possible. Let's give Suber a, a break for a play before we have to go back to him. Let's go split in drag. We're going zone. I got several options here. Let's do that just in case. Ah, just a good hit. We got some yards. There was a big hole over the middle, so I had to take it. Third and ten. We can do deep comeback. Go one zone. I'd love to run it. Man, this guy's coming up. I don't know what he's trying to do here. Ah. My bad. That's a touchdown. That's a good play by them. I saw him blitzing. We can go back and look at this. See big hole right here? That's why I threw it as early as I did. But the guy got an arm in front of it. Just not a good throw. Good play, though, by the defense. Man, so I got him back in it. 
I should have known. They went cover three, I think. I should have just went to the comeback and been done with it, but that's okay. He was open for a little bit. They got blitz from that spot, so that's why I hit that. Well, they finally got on the scoreboard, but it wasn't by their offense. Never is. Let's see if Williams can do something on this side. Oh, there are some holes on the right side. All right, let's just keep it simple. Let's go back to curl flat. They're going man. Everybody's coming. No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. What a play by the tight end. I had a... Th that was fixing to sack me. Let's see if we get a decent replay. This may be a good thumbnail. Look at his face. What in the world? There he goes. Looks better there. I'm going to go back. You see here, everybody, their brother's coming, so I need to get this off quick. But they do go cover zero. Somebody came through. Yeah. Just a very fortunate play by the tight end. Good for him. And he is gassed big time. Let's go back to counter. Counter has worked well for us more than anything else today on the ground. I don't know if that helped or not. And a face mask. Thank you. Another 15 yards. It's a 15 yarder. He tried to rip his head off. That gets us on the right hash. Our tight end is out. So we can pick something. And our halfback is out. Let's do X dig Z whip. That's doable. We haven't got to call that today. We're going man. They're bringing everybody. Good play there. And Cannon, who rarely plays, is there. We got a lot of backups in there. Good play, though. I could have went to quarter, but he, if it was Shakola, I would have went to him. So Super, I think, is back in there, but he's not feeling the best. I'm just trying to think of something to get it out quick. We'll go to Henry on this one. I almost got the touchdown. So we'll we'll try goal line. Let's try and see what I can do. I want to try. Let's do a fullback dive. Nope, just can't get anywhere. Just no push whatsoever. I need to figure out. Is it? I think it's right joystick up where he can just where he can uh, protect the ball. But anyway, as you can tell, nothing worked. They got him all up. He's Loss of two on the and everybody is out. I'm going to call a timeout. We're going to go offense. Let's go receiving. Let's get some bodies out there. We'll go back to turn in. So here we go. Looks like we're going zone. This will go to Jacola or Suber, which I'm perfectly fine with. Nope, they are going man. And a bad throw. I thought they went zone. So it's fourth and goal. Ah, let's just kick the field goal. I don't trust our goal line. Otherwise, I'd try to run it. But as you can tell, goal line, it just, it's very miss and miss. <laughs> and a block. Wow, what a block. Interesting. Wow, this has become a game. Kudos to Arkansas State. Their defense has played great all day. That's a good clean block. Now it's up to their offense to do something. If some of these teams' offenses would play as well as their defenses, or as their offenses, or the, yeah, the defenses, this would be a whole lot better game, but... Like blue 
Let's go over. I'm gonna go back to quarters. Sab, uh, not a big fan of. I prefer stack in this situation, but that's okay. Gonna play action. Somebody came through. I didn't pay attention. Mosley, of course. Just been our workhorse up front all year. Let's give him. Ah, eh, picked the wrong play. Let's do that instead. Now this guy's wide open right here. It ain't gonna make a difference. Didn't even go to him. And they're gonna punt. Let's do an all-out block. Definitely a defensive battle. Like I said, kudos to Arkansas State. They've done well in that department today. We will fair catch that one. Let's try another counter. If not, I'm going to have to do slam the rest of the way. Nope. Good defense. Second and nine. Let's just go back to curl flat. Let's run some clock. Probably a good idea. They're going zone here. We'll get cannon over the middle. I'll leave my protection as is. Getting down to a few seconds. That's a cool animation right there. So it's third and five. We'll go tight end corner. We're going man, so we'll go to Suber on this one. It's like they're going with that 46 bear look. I'm going to leave that protection as is. The clock has stopped. Stay in bounds. That ain't going to happen. That's okay. We still got the first. That's what matters. And he is not feeling it. Uh, let's give him a break. Let's do a basic dive with McNair. And I don't think slot protection matters in, in the run game. I could be wrong. Oh, look at this blocking. Just don't fumble it. Good blocking. Look at this. Look at this hole right here. Partner of the Red Sea. Great play. Wasn't expecting that. They call the timeout, so we will go offense. So let's go offensive line. Get Suber back out there. Let's go slam. Man. I'm going to leave it as is. Oh, well, well, we can try. I don't know if that helped or hurt. Just... I could have snapped it when that guy came across, but the, I'm still motioning that guy over. They called another timeout. We're going to go offense and offensive line again. Let's go slam from ace big. Man. I think that's their last timeout, if I'm not mistaken. That may be their second. Mm, good hit. We will accept that more than likely. Because it'll still be second. Yes. It'll, uh, yeah, definitely. Second and two. He is gassed. Twins flex. Let's do counter. Man. I will probably go to. I'm gonna go up to. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. Whatever this play is. I was hoping that was gonna be a dive. I wanted to go up the middle. McNair, good for him. Two key first downs. And that's our nope. They are out of timeouts, so we can. Don't think it matters at this point. 
Let's try Canner again. I'd love to score on him one more time. We're going zone here. Well, that guy came in perfectly, just no blocking whatsoever. And that's their last time out. I thought they had one more left. We'll go offense, offensive line. And Super is out. Let's just throw the ball. The game's over. It doesn't matter. We're going man here. Looking at our matchups. Okay. And they are going over the top to Jacoa. Six points. They went cover zero. I'm going to make you pay. Good for Jacoa. I think he's going to win the tight end of the year award. Cool to see the West Coast offense reward the tight end. He's earned it. He's played well. Let's see if we can get a good thumbnail here, possibly, maybe. So I don't know how many yards he's had. We can check it right here or I'll forget it. It's been all Jacola today. Eight receptions, 82 yards, two touchdowns. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Kick an extra point and we'll try to wrap this thing up. I do not expect their offense to do anything on me on the next drive. We'll go basic cover two man the rest of the way. This may, I don't know, I didn't pay attention to see where we were ranked. We'll check that on the simulation screen when it gets back out. It'll show us. I don't know how close we are to being a top 25, but I feel like we kind of earn it, deserve it now. We should take their spot for sure. Cover two man. Sad player of the game. Seven tackles, an interception, force fumbles, and a partridge in a pear tree. Good for him. Good throw. And they make the stop at the 42 yard line. They pick up solid yardage there. They should go no huddle here. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense. And the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. Leonard delivers as his fullback. Got out of bounds too. Second and four. So they execute move a little closer to the sticks. Yeah. Let's do cover two man. That's fine. Because it loves the defense to sleep a little bit. Then you can launch one big one down. Let's do this. They shift on the defensive line. They come out in a nickel. Leonard, back to pass. He throws it. That's a good throw. Has it to the senior. Knocked out of bounds. At the four. Attack the weakness, which is the linebacker on the receiver. Good job here by the wide receiver to get open. He created good separation from the defense. We'll just stick with the same thing. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you. Don't know where this was at before. They could have done this a whole lot earlier. Leonard, back to pass. He's been perfect on this drive. It's complete. A good open field tackle there. Nice pick up as they connect on the pass play. They look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. That's a glitchy play there. It's it went pistol, which is pretty cool. But nobody blocked him. Wow. Okay. He's going to shatter the records here. It's third and six. And somebody got to him. Fourth and nine. Fourth and six. Cover two man. I'll leave it as is. I don't. They are going with that formation. I don't mean. I don't think that means they're going play or a hail mary. I don't think that's a Hail Mary formation, and it's not. You can tell. Somebody came through again. You know who, Mosley, just having the just an amazing season. And that is the end of the game. Six seconds to go. We will take a knee. Hurry up to the line. And that is it. We'll check out some stats. Both the good and the bad. We'll go here. 
So Arkansas State had a grand total of 97 yards. Yay. Uh, their defense played great, though. It was one of the better defenses I've seen this year. Uh, we ran the ball okay for what we do. Passing was okay when I could get the ball off. I mean, their their pressure was really good. We was able to get to them a whole lot, though. But, again, it's just third down. It's just awful for them. And we had three turnovers today, and we still had no issues whatsoever. Uh, I want to go to individual. Craddock, 20-29. Two touchdowns, one interception. Super almost had 100 yards, but we didn't have any rushing touchdowns. All of our yards came through off a leg or through the air. And again, Chicola just had a great day. Good for him. Bobby Williams played great today as well. Henry, looks like everybody got to touch the ball a little bit in there. Let's go to defense. Oh, yeah, one thing I want to check. We'll go rushing, and this is the only place to really see this. That guy had two broken tackles. Defensively, Sab. J.K. Sab, seven tackles, one tackle for loss, interception. He had the forced fumble. Just a great day for him. I controlled him most of the game. I don't remember. He must have been one of those that got the forced fumble. I, I don't remember doing that myself. Cool to see all that, but again, the box score, just your typical, you know, typical stuff there. Okay, we'll get out of here and stay tuned. Okay, we're 31st in the country. We may get ranked in the next week. We did have a visitor today. We are going to, we're going to hurry this up and see if we get that commitment from that guy. That'd be good. Like it matters. It's like going to be my last season with this because I'm ready to move on to doing other things. And looks like he did not commit. Let's check him out. NC's recruiting. He's a soft verbal. So I guess what we picked, that he didn't like. So we'll stick with 50% across the board. We'll have this guy come to Louisiana Monroe, which apparently is the next game. And he likes our academics. So we should get a commit from this guy. And there we go. So we are set for recruiting. So in the next Dynasty video... We will take on Louisiana Monroe. They are 2-8, and eight, and they are absolutely awful. They're not good at anything. After that, though, we got number 6 Miami. That should be interesting. I expect them to beat us, but I also expect their offense to not do much as well. I hope I'm wrong. I'd like to see them put, hang up like 500 on us, but 400, uh, at least 300. That'd be even good as well. Because if you go back and look at this, our total defense, we're just not giving up a whole lot. We technically got the best defense in the country, and that shouldn't happen, but either way. All right, come on back. We'll take on Louisiana Monroe, and I'll talk to you later.